This is Bagana. A Jedi I knew discovered it before the Purge. You won't find it on any maps. The Empire doesn't know this place exists? No. So, what's the plan? We hide out here? We're done hiding, Cal. See that structure over there? I believe that vault holds the key to rebuilding the Jedi Order. But it requires someone strong in the Force to pass its test. And since you're not a Jedi anymore, that's why you need me. I know you don't trust me. And I'm not really sure I trust you. But we have a common enemy and a common cause. I'll share more of my plan after you reach the vault. But until then, there's someone here I think you should meet. May the Force be with you. I'm looking for a Jedi then. But if there's already one here, why does Seer need me? This looks like a safe place to meditate. Just need to focus my mind. Hey, BD-1. I'm Cal. Uh, yeah, I'm okay. I'm just I'm looking for someone. No, not you. I'm searching for a, a Jedi, I think. Hold on. Y you know the Jedi? What do you know? Wait, hold on! Did you just slice that? Thanks. That's the Vault Seer mentioned. Whoever I'm supposed to find must be waiting there. I sense something over here. That's a really big bug. after boggling eggs in the pack fought back. No way through here. Guess that's why BD-1 warned me. All right, maybe I'll listen to you next time.
Any ideas? Gotta get across this gap somehow. The zip line? <laughs> Whoa! How'd you know that would work? Wait, you didn't? Can't open it. Careful over there. That doesn't look safe. Just like back at the scrapyard. Whoever lived here used this room for storage. They kept food and supplies. Hey, that was pretty brave. You okay? with that. Will you let me? Oh, <laughs> okay. Hmm. Well, your scomp link is busted, but this should help you get moving for now. Okay, let's try that. Yeah, that's where I was headed too. Okay, well, first we gotta figure out a way out of this place. Uh, BD, that's a little small for me. Don't worry, I'll find my own way out. Tight fit, but this should work. Vines look like they lead somewhere. Hope they're sturdy. That's better. Thanks, little droid. Okay, let's try this again. Oh, uh. Okay. <laughs> Here, hop on board.
So, how'd you get here? Don't remember. I've never known a forgetful droid. Can't argue with that. Hey, a chest. Think the Jedi would mind if we grab supplies? That's where we need to go. I can feel it. Mapped everywhere we've been. <laughs> I can't make it over there. We gotta find another way. Tool was used by someone eager to reach the vault.
See something in there? Try again. It's difficult, Master. Yes, the path is difficult. It may seem impossible, but with persistence and the Force as your ally, you will overcome any obstacle. You will master any path. Now, do what you must to reach me. tricks. Think you can show me that shortcut again? This area was used for meditation by someone familiar with the Jedi Order. This bag brought it from Coruscant. They were frustrated with the Jedi Council.
Someone made camp here. They were excited to discover a giant creature that lives close by. A binog, they called it. See there? Oh, it's on. We're not finished yet. Okay, okay, he probably would have won. Probably. Beatty. Well done, whoever you are. You have passed the test I left behind and gained access to the vault and this recording, one of many encrypted logs stored in the droid. I am Master Ino Cordova. I may not know your name, but I know your purpose. The fate of the Jedi Order lies in your hands. This place, this vault is a sacred temple built by a vanished civilization known as the Zephyr. Meditating here, I was granted a premonition through the Force, a vision of doom. I have placed inside this vault a Jedi holocron containing a list of the names and locations of young Force sensitives throughout the galaxy. Ahead, you will find the inner chamber of the vault, but also another test. I can only trust this holocron to someone who has followed my path and understands. Seek out the hidden tombs of the three sages and learn to perceive the mysteries of the Force as the Zephyr once did. In this droid, you will find everything you need to succeed on this journey. Go to the Zephyr homeworld. There, you will find peace in the eye of the storm. Good luck, Jedi. And may the Force be with you. I guess you were the someone I was supposed to meet. <laughs> I've been alone for a while now, without any purpose, just hiding. There's no way to live, not for a Jedi or a droid. Maybe Seer was right. 
Maybe we're done hiding. Hey, you want to meet some uh, friends of mine? I think I found what you wanted me to see. Sounds like you did. We'll be waiting. friend, it appears the Zepho had some interest in Dathomir. Strange. For such a peaceful culture to have any sort of fascination with a place so dark. something? Should be a lot quicker than the way in.
Hi there. Making a new friend? Pass the test. So you knew about BD-1? <laughs> Come on board. We'll talk inside. Oh, BD-1, this is Grease. Hey, Grease. What is that? <laughs> get off my sofa! Get, get off my sofa! No! Get out of there! Get out! That is BD-1. He's with us. I don't care who he's with. Do you have any idea how hard it is to get oil stains out of petroleum fabric? Not really. Oh. I hope you found something better out there than this droid. Oh, calm down, Grease. He did. Tell us, Cal. The vault was built by an ancient civilization called the Zepho. A Jedi named Eno Cordova hid something inside of it. What did he hide inside? A holocron from the archives. It contains a list of Force-sensitive children. The next generation of Jedi. I knew it! Ah, oh, Cordova, you old fool. You knew him? Yes. A long time ago. I was his apprentice. Cordova was a loner. And that little droid and I are probably the only ones that know about Pagano. Hold on, wait a minute, wait a minute. A holo what? A holocron. It stores information, but only accessible to Jedi. Hang on, I think I have one around here. Use the Force. This is Master Obi-Wan Kenobi. I regret to report that both our Jedi Order and the Republic have fallen. With that list of Force sensitives, we could rebuild the Jedi Order and defeat the Empire. Okay, no problem. Let's get it! Well, except the Holocron is hidden deep inside the vault, and to get it, we have to follow Cordova's path. He mentioned something about the planet Dathomir and a Zeppo homeworld. All right, well, where are we going? I'm just asking, because I was thinking of maybe making some food. Look, before we do anything, I need to know something. How come you're no longer a Jedi? I had an experience that changed my perspective. So I cut myself off from the Force. But you still want to rebuild the Order. I believe that rebuilding the Order is the best chance we have against the Empire. What do you believe? I believe I can't keep hiding from the Empire, so I don't really have a choice. Cal, as long as you're alive, you will always have a choice. Are you with us? We're in. Death Mirror Zepho, it's your choice. Get some seeds in here. If you're not ready to leave, don't bother me. Seer, can you feel the force at all? Yes. But instead of opening up, I push it back down. The exact opposite of what you should do. Out there, I remembered something about myself before the purge. It was painful, but like I found a piece of myself. That's good. You're learning to embrace the Force again. How can you say that? Because I know what it means to live without it. Okay. I'll keep trying. This whole journey has put a lot of wear and tear on the Manus. Like it was perfect before? It was a masterpiece, but now, ugh, just don't be surprised if I send you a bill. Someone's low on funds. I mean, sure, okay, that may be part of it, but I'm used to it. Were you rich growing up? 
Wealth isn't really a priority for Jedi. Yeah, well, I was poor too, but it wasn't so bad. My crew and I would find things to do for cheap. That's where I learned how to play Subhawk. A game which requires credits. Strange choice. Well, we were kids. We bet all kinds of dumb things from food to funny-shaped rocks. Unfortunately, things changed when we got older. Funny-shaped rocks didn't go so far anymore. The galaxy would be a better place if they did. All right, kids, sit down. We're here. <laughs>